Hello everyone, my name is Loco and welcome to another Hearthstone Heroes of Warcraft video. Recently I managed to get to rank number 4 and I'm actually currently rank number 4 with 0 stars, so hopefully I won't drop below rank number 4 in this video. Um, however, I'm gonna try my very best to ladder up some more and I plan on making one of these videos every single time I get a actual rank up until, you know, legendary. Um, obviously I'm currently rank 4 right now and I previously made one for rank 5. Gonna be playing the exact same deck as I did in the previous game as well, so... All in all, this should be alright, this should be alright. Hopefully I will be able to get to rank 3 um, in the pretty near future though, and hopefully I'll be able to make it to maybe Legend all the way this month. I'm sort of hoping that will be what happens. Anyways, it's going to be once again the Zulok deck, I'm going to be up against a guy named FF... FAF Angel, um, and obviously, um, if you are interested in the deck list, make sure you check it right below that like button, as I will post a link right there. Um, but everything that you need to know about this deck. Now, I'm trying to figure out um, what we're gonna do right here, turn one. I'm thinking of coining out the Knife Juggler, as I don't have anything else. Um, I could coin out an Iron Big Owl, but that's not gonna happen, so... Let's hope he doesn't have anything to buff it up, or maybe a boar or something. That would really mess things up right away from the get-go. Um, but anyway, I'm currently rank 4, and hopefully I'll be able to work my uh, my way all the way to rank number 3 in the near future. Although things are getting a lot more difficult right now. But we'll see. Alright. Mm, this is a bit of a tricky one. Obviously, uh, we are going to play a minion right now, and I could actually soul fire the other one if I really wanted to, but... It's kind of a scary one. Alright, let's see what it hits. As long as it does not hit the hunter, I'm okay. Any of the minions. Alright, there we go. Um, so the knife juggler is definitely gonna kill one of those. Uh, we do have a nice turn 3 play, and we also have to- No, I don't really want to discard any of these items. So yeah, I'm gonna have to- I'm, I'm gonna have to just hit him in the face right here. Not the most ideal opener so far for me, to be completely honest. Like, these- this- This is all cards, I really want to keep, but... Oh well, we'll see. Oh snap. Is he gonna trade completely here? He's actually gonna go face. Alright. Um... I think I'm just gonna play my Harvest Golem right here. And probably trade with the, um, with the Huffer. It's a bit of a frustrating thing, but... I guess it's okay. I need to be playing, uh, I need to be playing a little bit more control focused. Can't really be going for the phase all the time. Uh, that's one of the main things when playing Zoo, you really want to make sure you trade as most efficiently as possible. And so far, I've really not made very many efficient trades, but it's alright. Looks like my opponent does not really have much of a turn 3 play. If he's gonna actually face my Harvest Golem, I'm completely okay with that. He decides to not go for that, but that is still okay. Um, looks like we actually have another Dire Wolf right here, so that's good. I'm gonna be life tapping right here. Looks like it's gonna be the Iron Big Owl, but I'm just gonna play the Dire Wolf Alpha right now and hit him in the face. Um, he's likely gonna waste his second bow on it, which I am honestly completely okay with. Um, as it is, you know, it is a very valuable bow right now at this point in the game, especially if he has, like, secrets and stuff, so... I'm okay with this. Don't really want him to get, um, too many, uh, durabilities on this one. What?! Really? You're gonna play the angry chicken? Whoa! I did not expect that. I did really not expect that. Um, okay. <laughs> um, so the trap. What would that trap most likely be? Well, I would expect it right now to be a freezing trap, or an explosive trap right now. Um, is there really any other options? I'm not completely sure, but we'll see. Is it, next is it really a freezing trap? Are you really going to freezing trap that? Oh, right. Thing is, why does he hey, play the angry chicken and then not buff it up, right? Oh, well. I guess I guess I'm just gonna Iron Beak Owl this one and hit it in the face right there. Have to be a little bit careful in these sort of situations, but um, I think I'm more than okay just playing it out like this. Um, obviously, the angry chicken is gonna stay alive for one turn right here, but he really needs to buff it up if he wants to get anything done with it. And I have a soul fire as well as an abusive sergeant in hand to deal with this, so... I don't think he's ever gonna buff it up. Oh snap, does he have the explosive trap right now? Oh snap. Whoa, he's actually going face with it, okay. This is, this is the weirdest angry chicken I've seen in a while, but there's actually quite a threat, there's actually quite a threat right now. I'm a little bit worried for it. Oh, well, that's the Defender of Argus we were hoping for, though. That's a really nice one. Um, let's see. Um... I'm actually gonna life tap first, I might as well. 
And I'm gonna play the Den Defender of Argus between those two. Hit that thing in the face. Hit that thing in the face. And finish this one off as well. Alright. We are definitely making a little bit of progress right here. I am free to play the Doomguard next turn if I don't draw like uh, my... Um, yeah, if I don't draw any of my most important minions, but I think this is all alright. Need to watch out actually, I'm getting really low life. Not liking it. Hmm, he's actually gonna have lethal in a couple turns if I'm not careful. Alright. We can try and trigger a couple of funky things here. First off, I can obviously... Yeah, I can obviously hit him in the face right there. That is okay. Actually gonna wait, I'm gonna trade these guys. Force that minion out of him. Go for the Nerubian egg and hit him in the face. I'm hoping that's an explosive trap. It is an explosive trap. Alright, that's great for us. Uh, which means that we should have lethal just barely in time. Um, to actually finish things off in the combination with these cards right here. Should just barely have it, I'm pretty sure of it. Uh, we have 9, 11... Yeah, we have lethal next turn, so, you know, if he doesn't have, like, a kill command in hand, or an Unleash the Hounds, we win. Hope so! Or a boar. <laughs> or anything that can attack me this turn, really. I'm secretly hoping so. He's not playing it very quickly, so I don't think he has lethal right here. Either that or he's BMing me right now. Oh, come on, FAF Angel. You don't seem to want to BM. Oh, he is BMing, isn't he? I think he is. I think he is, yeah. He's definitely mousing over for... He's, he's definitely mousing over it for a little bit too long. So I think he has lethal here. Is he really gonna... Is he really gonna go all the way to the rope? I mean, like, no, no, it's it's never gonna be, it's never gonna be him just trying to make a decision for two cards. Oh, oh. What are you doing? Oh my god, that is dirty. That is dirty right there. Oh, okay, I'll, oh well, oh well. Looks like we uh, managed to drop all the way back to rank 5 right here. Ugh. Don't think I would ever be disappointed seeing rank 5, but alright, let's play another one, let's play another one. I want to get back to rank 4 at the very least in this video. At least I hope I will be able to. Uh, this was uh, this was too bad though, we had a couple of pretty bad draws, our opening hand was not, uh, not very good at all. Um, and uh, we were pretty close to lethal, I might have made a misplay though, but I'm not completely sure. I think I played quite decent, but we'll see. Malfurion! Alright, this is a good opener. This is a good opening hand. Um, I think I'm actually gonna keep both. Might as well. Or all three, I mean. Might as well. Direwolf Alpha is one of these cards that I might not have really wanted. I'd rather wanted, like, the Haunted Creeper, but this is still... This is alright. He actually has the Legend card back. Alright, gonna start with the Undertaker. If my opponent has a Wrath, he might coin it out. He might decide to wait another turn. Um, but we will see. I greet you. I greet you. Loot Elias. Loot Elias? Um, not gonna get too greedy here. Just gonna play these two minions. Could have played the Knife Juggler if I really wanted to, but then it would be... Would be getting a little bit too greedy, I don't like that. Mm, that's his Hunter Creeper right there. Surprisingly not scary. Um... Couple ways we could try and clean this up. I hope he doesn't have a swipe. He does have the coin, so we need to watch out for that. But all my minions have pretty high health. Um, we could try and be a little bit greedy here. Do we really want to be this greedy? Do we really want to be this greedy? I think we do. Come on, hit one of them. Hit one of them, knife juggler. One of them. Come on. That's a good boy. Alright, it could coin out a swipe right now if you really wanted to, but he's not gonna end up killing very much now, look at it. Nox Ramos. Swipe is one of these cards that can be extremely good or extremely bad. And in this case... Ooh, in this case, do I rather play it in Ruby and Egg or not? Um, considering he's gonna be 4 mana next turn, do I really want that? Um... Nah, I will, I will, I will, I will play the Nerubian Egg right now instead of the Direwolf Alpha. Don't really need the Alpha 
dire wolf thing right now. Just gonna hit him in the face. This is actually gonna be lethal really quickly if the guy isn't careful. I can actually, I actually have lethal next turn. Alright, he is gonna swipe right now. But that's alright with me. Um, we have six. Now we have 11 damage right here. <laughs> I was trying to figure out if he had already lethal, but no. Um, don't wanna, no, I kinda, I kinda wanna trade in this, this, uh, okay. Knife juggler. Right now it's important not to hit that minion. It wouldn't be the worst, but... Alright, alright, alright. And I guess I'm just gonna play this guy as well. Oh my god, and he already says, <laughs> I can see to you. This was a bit of a dirty game. This is why people hate Zoo. <laughs> alright, alright, alright. That was okay with me though, I'm not complaining. I'm not complaining in the slightest. Let's play another one, let's play another one. That was a good quick game right there though. Um, yeah, I don't need to know how long that one took. I think it was like 4 or 5 minutes at the very most. Maybe even less than that. <laughs> Mr. Druid was not catching the cards that he was hoping for right there. Alright, let's play another one. Looks like the last one is going to be against a hunter. I don't know exactly if this is the same guy as the first game we played. It could be. Um... I'm actually gonna get rid of these two. I like the Haunted Creeper. I'd rather have like a Harvest Golem or something. Maybe a Lepronome? Alright, this is not bad. This is alright. I wonder if it's the same guy, I'm not too sure. Hmm, that's a really frustrating. Oh, well, okay, it was really frustrating. Until he, uh... He... Or the game rather gave me the leper gnome. Uh, I was trying to think out loud right there. Um, gonna do it like this. I was having a bit of an issue deciding how I'm gonna play this, but this is not okay with me. Don't think any of the hunters really run the ball anymore. It used to be like a, a bit of a, a thing that you would see quite often, but right now it's kind of uncommon. Alright, we can play the haunted creeper next turn already, and at that point it's gonna be really a force to be reckoned with. Oh, he's not really careful with it though. Hmm. Maybe I actually rather play the Ruby and Egg right now. Considering there's a big chance that it's gonna be a flame or a explosive trap. I mean all hunters right now run explosive traps, so this is pretty solid. Next turn I will simply just be able to hit him in the face and maybe get a free 4-4 in the Ruby out of it. Oh, I think it is. I think it is exactly that, else he would never kill Commander. Is it actually? Huh. This is an interesting one right now, because I really want him to... Give me the free card. <laughs> give me the free 4-4. Four, four. Um, I think I'm gonna have to life tip right here. And I think I'd rather play the Void Walker than the Flame Imp, yeah, definitely. One of the cards that I don't really like too much in this deck is the Void Walker. It has very limited use, and this is one of them, but... Ooh. Double knife joke. Or a double, uh... Loot Hoarder. You think he has the Explosive Trap here? I'm not sure. Well, we just drew another one, so I'm pretty happy. Explosive Trap? Oh, it's a Freezing Trap. That's too bad. Alright. We will play a little bit greedy. We'll play a little tiny bit greedy here. Okay, just hit both of them. Oh, come on. One of them at least done. Oh my god. Really? Really, Mr. Knife Juggler? Really? Not gonna give me a chance even? Well, he's still, you know... Oh wow. I was gonna say he still is gonna have to lose both of them, but this is alright with me, I suppose. He's still gonna end up losing both of them, except for the fact that my uh, minion right there is dead, but... Okay, an owl would be nice. That's not an owl. Doesn't even look like an owl. Um, I might just still want to play my Doom Guard here. Yeah. No real reason not to. <laughs> really? You get rid of those two? Man! The RNG is not with me in this game, but... We still, uh, we still are in here. We're still not uh, looking that bad. I don't, th I don't think it realizes that we had some pretty poor luck so far. But all right, animal companion. 
Sadly for him, it's not a huffer, and that Eagle Horn Bow is not going to do very much either. Really? Kill Command? Or oh, Hunter's Market? Wow! He's actually going to take the damage to the face? Oh man, alright. I guess it's a smart way of him for dealing with it, but... Um, let's see. Well, I think I'm going to play my Defender of Argus. Don't really see why I wouldn't. Alright, here we go. Need to get a bit more card draw going. He's gonna be forced to use his Eagle Horn Bow right there. Um, so I'm okay with dealing like this. In case it's like an Unleash the Hounds or something that he's still having in hand. Um, I really don't want him to have that, um, what's that guy even called? Lee Rock or something? Lee Rock? Leok, Leok, there we go. Um, I have two Owls in the deck, so I'd really like to draw one right now. Doesn't look like an Owl. Um... Let's see. We could actually play the Knife Juggler as well as the Defender of Argus right now. Uh, that would be kind of annoying. Then run it in. Would that be the smart way of doing this? We so could play it first. But then it wouldn't pop anymore. I really want that egg to pop. Um, we could play Knife Juggler right now. First run that thing in. It will keep it at 4 life and then... Hope the <laughs> we kind of hope that the knife will land there. Um, all right, we hope that the knife lands right there. Come on, knife. We have two chances. Nope, first chance not. Come on, land it right there. Oh my god, that's not it either. Well, we can still we can still hit it, I suppose. That's too bad. I was hoping that this knife would land right there. At least one of them would save me a bunch of damage, but. Does he have another death rattle? No, he does not. Actually, having the iron for Grizzly. Oh, he obviously got that from the. Uh, he obviously got that from the uh, web spinner. Oh well, he's taking a lot of damage to the face though with all these um, trades that he's doing with the bow. So this is still acceptable for me. Gonna have to hero tap or life tap. Um, I guess we're just playing a bunch of minions here, right? Um, let's see, how would we trade things? We would probably trade like that. Um, Into the breach. You're too good not to trade like that. Into you're also too breach. good to not trade like that. Uh, so we're gonna play two minions right now. I think I'm gonna play the Harvest Golem and the Voidwalker. And come on, one other one. Of course you don't. But it's okay. At least we have the Void Walker back in the game. And he says, Well fought! I concede to you. Lovely. And we are back at rank 4 with one more star than we started in this video. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit that like button. If you really enjoyed it and you want to see more, make sure you hit that subscribe button. But whatever you do, make sure to actually comment below if you are actually playing Hearthstone and what rank you currently are. I want to thank you guys all for watching, have an amazing day, do not forget to smile, and I'll see you in the next one.